Hello guys and welcome to this course on Microsoft Word 2016. In the previous lesson of this course and in section 1, I told you about the course agenda and what we will cover in this course and what is the procedure of our learning in this course, what we will learn first and what we will learn next. So in this particular lesson, I will be teaching you how you can modify existing templates that come by default with the office package that you download so basically once you download the office package for example when you download Microsoft Word some existing templates are also downloaded onto your PC and are stored in the templates folder on your computer or laptop whatever you're using so where are they stored so first of all I'm going to tell you that from where you can get to those templates so you need to open up your file explorer first in Windows 10 it's named as file explorer and in previous versions of Windows such as Windows 7 it is named as Windows Explorer so once you've op opened up your file explorer you need to navigate to your C drive and inside the C drive you need to navigate to users double click on this users folder and inside this users folder there will be a subfolder or you can also call that folder your own folder as well because it's named Said Ali which is the name of your laptop or computer that you're using so open up this folder and inside this folder I need to find a folder app data and if you don't find it at first don't worry because you need to unhide that folder it is in the hidden folders of the file explorer so how do you unhide these folders it's very simple you just need to click view over here and just check this box which says hidden items notice if I uncheck this box all the hidden folders will be hidden on this PC and as soon as I check this box all the hidden items or folders will be displayed on this file explorer so let's open up app data over here navigate to roaming then navigate to Microsoft over here and then simply go to templates right over here double click templates and you can see that I have a uh, couple of default templates that have been downloaded onto my PC when I downloaded the office package so you can see that I have this personal letterhead dot dotx file and so on and don't worry with these file extensions don't get confused they are really simple because the first one is dotm which is dot m and the second one is dotx which is dot x so the basic difference between these two file extensions is that the .m file extension contains macros and the .x file extension is without macros. So what are macros? Macros are just an automated series of steps. So no need to worry on this. So let's open up this personal letterhead .dot .dotx file. So open up with Word 2016. So you can see that I have this default template personal letterhead opened up in my Word 2016. I can change the font of this and I can modify it in any way I like. I can choose this font, I can change the size of this and then I can also select the date change the name over here of the recipient change the image change my name over here and so on so this is how you can easily modify existing templates that are downloaded onto your computer when you download the office package so this is very simple I hope you understand I hope you learned from this lecture so stay tuned stay focused and let's move to our next lesson